Plus the game, I'm on the bar, I couldn't be the boss, so I had to do a little time. No, no kills, it gives you advice, I hit shit, old nigga, no, we slime. Matter shit out before we go on the drill, we gon' spend it all block, we ain't doing no ass. Fuck on the roof, we got cut in the cuff, we don't hear us on murder, they doing their time. Zone in the water, we swim piranhas, they kill it, be kill some shots, just bang. We do no leg, run out with that package, you want to see. What's going on, YouTube? It's your boy, Crazy the Great, and I'm the Flyers reporting on the Eagles. And today, I will be chopping it up with y'all about the top free agents that's still available, available that's in the NFL. But first, I want to ask y'all, do you think, Philly fans, do you think um, how it's done? Do you think that we are done um, with this roster? But um, I don't believe that we are done. I, I feel like how he got one more move up his sleeve. And um, But first, I just want to uh, go over these free agents, the top free agents that's currently still available for us. And at number one, they got uh, DeAndre Hopkins. Uh, number two, they got Yannick Nagagwe. And number three, they got Dalvin Cook. Number four, we got uh, Jadavion Clowney. And number five, we got Dalton Reisner. And at number six, they got Marcus Peters. Number seven, they got Melvin Ingram. Number eight, they got Teddy Bridgewater. Number nine, they got Bryce Callahan. And then number 10, they got Justin Houston. And then number 11 coming in at the finalist is John Houston. I don't know who that is, but but yeah, man, I feel like um, if I was Howie, I probably would pick up Yannick Nagagwe because I feel like you can never go never go wrong with too much depth, having too much depth with, with the defensive line. Or either picking up DeAndre Hopkins because um, what if um, knock on wood? What if the say on uh, AJ Brown or uh, or Devonte Smith got injured? Then who we re rely on to rely to rely on to is uh, what Quiz Watkins? I mean he's good, and um, but really we're not really after those two. We're not really deep at the wide receiver position. But honestly, I probably still would take. Yannick Nagagwe because that's what what we um we live and die by by the uh the defensive line man like if, if you can't get to the quarterback then we don't really win games like that but honestly those would be my my top two picks either Yannick Nagagwe or uh DeAndre Hopkins but um moving on to man uh the NFL and, and uh PFL rank uh Hassan uh, Reddick as a top as a top ten uh, defensive lineman in the NFL, and of course, you know, in my opinion, I feel like he's he's been that for the longest. I feel like he's better than than Michael Parsons. Look, I'm not being biased. I'm just saying, like, um, I'm not gonna let ESPN and uh, all these analysts um, persuade me to believe that he's the best. Um, defensive player that we've seen since LT, like that's just not facts. Like every time we play, every time Michael pa Michael Parson play play with us, he get his ass handed to him. Like he he, I mean he will get some pressure, but he he don't really be a factor because Lane be shutting him down. Really, the whole line be shutting him down when he move. Even when he go to Jordan Malata, Jordan Malata, like he'll he'll kind of give Malata some trouble, but he still don't hit home. Like, don't get me wrong, Michael Parsons is a uh, is a dog, but I just don't feel like he's the best the best defensive player in the league. Like me personally, I feel like T.J. White is the best um, defensive lineman in the NFL. Like before his injury, dude was just going crazy, man. Like dude just that that consistent time in and time out. But yeah, man. Like, do you think do you think how he's done, or do you think we're gonna be picking up? Um, one of these on uh, free agents, but I, I feel like it's gonna boil down to uh, to one of those two, Yannick Ngagwe or DeAndre Hawkins, or possibly probably uh, Jadavion Clowney. I don't see us picking up uh, Dalvin Cook because you know I run a running back room already stacked. But uh, yeah, man, that's all I got for y'all today. And, and another thing too, like um, for all you new subscribers that um that have recently subscribed to my channel yesterday um i just want to say thank you and uh i appreciate, I appreciate y'all for subscribing to my channel and shout out to uh smitty eagle and uh 
Coles Cowboy, man. They they showed me some love on that platform yesterday. So y'all go sub them two guys, man. They've been doing it for a while. And um, you know, all them folks inspired me to uh, do this where I'm going right now. So, you know, um, if you made it this far in the video, um, like I said again, I salute you. And I appreciate y'all, man. Y'all um, like and subscribe and leave a comment in the comment section, man. Because, you know, I rip the birds. And if you rip the birds, man, that's all that matters, man. So, once again, I'm crazy to great. And I'm out.